Hi, Judd here, huddling in the shade at the moment. This is the end of the report, but I gotta start with what I started with. I wasn't planning on doing a report. I got a bunch of stuff to show you. So we're gonna start with this, which I saw first thing this morning. Right down here, here's my beautiful Mexican petunia. And today, okay, that one's kinda hanging. We got five buds, but one of them is down on this new shoot. Look at that. So we got the new babies coming in. Looking good on the petunia. And we'll take you on to the rest of the adventures of the day. Weird. <laughs> Hi, good morning. Judd here. I just wanted to share a quickie little thing here with you. That? That's a steering wheel. Down here in Florida, it's hot. That sun comes in here uh, very, very hot and gets that wheel very, very hot. Sometimes so hot you can't even touch it. So what did I do? I went to Walmart and I got a giant heavy-duty roasting pan. And I came out here for $3.95. I tried to find a cover, I couldn't, and I just molded it to fit that. And now I have a beautiful steering wheel cover, and I can come out and take that off, and my steering wheel is nice and cool. Okay, so here I am at LKQ Auto Parts, getting a new, uh, not new, a used uh, distributor for the Honda. See if that makes it work. Uh, just had the thought that might have been vandalism, actually, what killed that car. I gotta look into that. But anyways, I gotta come back in about an hour. I've bought the part, but they gotta pull it or something and get it down here. So I'll be back here in an hour, and then we'll go fix the Honda. While I wait for my part at LKQ, I've come down here to the waterside to the ice cream shoppy. I'm gonna have a dish of vanilla ice cream right on the riverside in Kings River. This is where Bird's Underwater Dive Shop is. That's where I got my wetsuit. They have manatee tours and all that nifty stuff here and paddle boards and kayaks, scallop supplies. Everyone's got scallop supplies, baby. Scalloping is a thing. Everybody's gone scalloping. Okay. There's King Bay. Out there you can see Pete's Pier. We've been there before on one of my trips. Okay, so we'll go upstairs. This is right on the roadside in Crystal River. That's 19 right there, that highway out there. Boom, boom, boom. See the truck going by. Birds Underwater Dive Center. You can learn to dive there, too. I always thought I ought to do that. Get certified as a diver. Restaurant over there on the waterfront. But we're going to the ice cream shop. <laughs> Woo! Air conditioning. Ha <laughs> ha. Hello! Good, I need an ice cream. Oh, look at all the ice cream. I'm just making everyone jealous. Oh, lots of ice cream. I want a uh, dish of, uh, a small dish of chocolate chip, please. We don't have regular chocolate chip. We have chocolate chip cookie dough. Okay, well, I got a dish of vanilla ice cream smothered in Jimmy's. They didn't have chocolate chip. They only had chocolate chip cookie dough, which doesn't do me any good. We don't do cookie dough. And this is looking out on Kings Bay. I'm out on the balcony on the second floor here of the ice cream shop -y. The guy just told me the scallopers, I said, you know, must get busy here when the scallopers come in. He said they come in at 7.30, and they go out very early in the morning. That is a long, long day. So anyways, I'm going to sit here in the balcony in the shade, boom, and enjoy my chocolate chip ice cream before I go get my part at LKQ. My new part from LKQ for the Honda when I get around to that and I also have received in the mail a cypress knee for a little carving project I have in mind if I ever get up the gumption to get around to doing that just gonna do a quick unboxing here to show you what this is I got this from Etsy which I found on a quick search online and it saves me driving all over looking for this thing not something you can find at Walmart a lot lighter than I expected there you go that my friends is what is called a cypress knee okay and that is good that's good that's gonna work for me I wanted a single knob at top and uh, there we go we have to clean it up. This is how they come naturally. This is with the bark on it. But we got a little project in mind for this. And uh, see if we ever get to it. 
Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, I'm gonna have to flatten that base off. It's a little crooked. Yeah. There was a crooked knee. <laughs> it's kind of like my knee, kind of crooked. Okay, so there you go. That's the adventures of the day. Happy day to you.